Today, I'll be showing you how to do your Hobie Wallet crypto taxes. Hello, my name is Nelly from Coinly and welcome back to another wallet integration video. This is sort of an update video, so I'll be using some footage from the past and some new footage because this wallet is one I covered three months ago and since then they have added um, an API option, so it'll probably make it a lot easier to integrate this wallet into Coinly for you know those of you that actually do have it. So just like the other video, I'll talk a little bit about the wallet itself, then I'll show you the integration both with the CSV file and the API method and then you know i'll show you how to get your um, tax documentation really easily and then lastly if you have any questions feedback stuff like that i'll leave some resources where you can go so this exchange is based out of beijing um, china and was founded in 2013. Um, they are predominantly a crypto to crypto exchange with 300 different crypto assets they have a lot of features they have derivative staking pools and they're constantly adding new ones they have trading bots otc and they have even their own rewards program um, this you know is probably the reason they're one of the biggest exchanges by trading volume usually ranking in the top 10 sometimes even in the top five um, by this metric so that's enough about the wallet let me show you how to do the integration okay so starting off like we always do um, head over to coinly log into your account and then go into the wallet section here we're going to click add new wallet and then we're going to find the hubai wallet hubi wallet and here we're going to click on this and last time in the old video i said there was no um, api option that has obviously changed since then so first i'll show you the api option then i'll jump into footage from the old video where i show you how to get the csv file so click on set up autosync and one small thing to note here only last four months of trade history can be retrieved so that means that you know your deposits and withdrawals all that stuff is going to be included uh, in, its, in its entirety however um for trade history it's only the last four months so you're gonna have to find another way to import the remaining trade history information so we're looking for the api key and we're looking for the api secret which i'll show you how to get on their website okay so we're here on the exchange and in the top right corner there is a little profile icon um, from that menu we're going to click api management and here we're going to create a key so make sure permission settings you're only interested in the read only um, option Coinly is not interested in withdrawing or trading any of your funds. Notes, I don't know, you can call it Coinly if you like. Um, this other thing you do not have to worry about, it's optional. Then we're going to click create. So please tick to confirm that you're aware of the following risks. This is, these are standard risks um, on any exchange when you're creating a um, you know an API key. So we're going to click yes to all. And we're going to click I understand. And now we're going to need the um, authentication from our email to continue this procedure okay so once we've done that um, here we have the API key so we're gonna copy that paste it here in the API key section and we have the API secret we're gonna copy that and paste it here once we're done we're, we're good with that we're gonna click confirm and then we're gonna click secure import and it's pretty straightforward that's all you have to do for the API method now I'll show you how to do the CSV file import so same thing as before we're gonna hit the Hubi wallet we're gonna click import from file and now I'll jump into some older footage where I show you where to get these files um, from their exchange okay so jumping into our Hubi wallet in the top right corner we're gonna click order and then exchange and margin uh, orders and then here we're gonna click on order history. Okay, so here you will see your recent trades, but please keep in mind that it's only the last four months. So if you choose the custom time, you won't be able to go back more than four months as I'm showing here on screen right now. In order to download these last four months, this these orders, you will go into the top right corner and there's a little icon that says uh, export order history. Okay, next we're gonna go into our deposits and withdrawals. So go to balances and click exchange accounts and in brackets it says deposits and withdrawals and the top right corner here you have the history um, button you're going to click on that okay now here's the slightly tedious part there is no export button here meaning you will have to import this uh, stuff manually into coinly so you'll have to manually create um, transactions and I have made a video about that I will leave it in the top right corner right now and I will leave it in the description of this video so please make sure to make manual transactions for deposit history withdrawal history um, conversion and other history you do not have to do it 
for transfer history. And now you're saying, well, now it's extremely tedious. Is there a way around it? And most people are, you know, gonna have accounts that are older than four months and you'll have to click here where you will basically um, request uh, Hubai to send you the necessary files for your account. So make sure to write a nice description. Your starting date will be from, you know, the beginning of when you create your account till the end and select all of these options so you get the full history and you will also need to verify um, your account by you know taking a picture of yourself with your ID and whatnot um, and then in the next couple of days they will send you the necessary files and hopefully you actually don't need to create manual transactions so there is a way around that and this is probably the best route but it might take a few days okay picture Nelly is back um, so after they've sent you those files or after you've downloaded your files if your account is less than four months um, you're gonna take that file or those files and just simply drag and drop into Coinly and then you're going to import and um, you're gonna have your transactions uh, and your you know the coins you're dealing with all that good information um, in Coinly so we have four transactions the different cryptos I'm working with and there you have it and now that we have that here's the best part of all is how easily you can get your necessary tax documentation so we go to tax reports you'll get a breakdown of your transactions your deposits you can select which year you're working with um, and then from there you can you know just get a good sense of you know what your portfolio is like what your capital gains are like and all that and at the very bottom you will um, request to download a um, do tax document you will select the plan that best suits your needs and then you can select from you know a bunch of different tax documents depending on which country you're from and as always um, I'm gonna give you some options you know depending on where you're from this is a pretty massive international wallet so there's gonna be a lot of you know viewers from all over the world so for the URS we have the IRS schedule D form 8949 you can also export to TurboTax both online and desktop for the UK, we have the HMRC Capital uh, Gain Summary. We have reports for Norway, Sweden, France, Switzerland. And lastly, we have the complete tax report for Australia, Canada, or if you'd like to send this to an accountant. Um, we're also working on content um, you know, for accountants, so you can invite your accountant to Coinly and for accountants to set up their agencies, their, their firms within Coinly. So stay tuned for more content around that and lastly as I always say depending on which country you're in look into um, if you can deduct this the cost of this report um, with your taxes so depending on where you're from you might be able to get a tax deduction because Coinly is a software that helps you with your taxes and a lot of places in the world do have you know exemptions and deductions for stuff like that but that brings us to the conclusion of this video i will leave you with some resources and we've added some new ones um let's start off with the first and most obvious one the coinly help center has countless articles on crypto tax information if you'd like to learn about specific areas and topics that you may be uh, unaware of then we have a feedback section here you can you know make requests for different wallets or report any bugs you might see or other issues like that then we have a forum section where you can talk to members of our community as well as our staff and then lastly we have a support section or a contact section sorry where you can send us a message or send us an email and we'd be happy to get back to you but if you found this video helpful in any way consider dropping a like subscribing for more crypto content and i'll see you next time peace